world of Disney today. How are you guys doing? Thanks for spending your Saturday morning with me. Such a fun way to start the weekend. He really is a cutie, Donna. I agree. He's adorable. I'm not the biggest Winnie the Pooh fan, um, although my daughter really likes him, and so I kind of like him through that. But I will say that this collection is darling. It's so sweet and simple and just, it's just really lovely. All right guys, let's start getting a closer look at it. Thank you guys again so much for joining me. Um, if you missed who I am, I'm Lindsay. I am at World of Disney and Disney Springs today. So let's take a look at this. There's a lot of home collection. I'm going to start with the Winnie the Pooh one because it's my favorite. But then we're just going to kind of walk around the home um, section of World of Disney a little bit. So they have it set up here in a cute little display and it looks so pretty together. And this is really the only place where you can see all of the canisters out. So I'm sorry about the reflection on the glass. You get that cute little honeycomb look around the edges of the canister. And then the canisters have those beautiful, just really clean, simple tops. So pretty. I love the engraved look on the top of them. They're, they're gorgeous. Now here is our red can. I really need one of these and this would go pretty well in my kitchen. I love it. I know and it's so cute. So on the top of it, it says bread. You've got Winnie the Pooh. He looks like he's been eating a little bit of bread right there, doesn't he? I love his little chubby belly. And then I think my favorite thing on the whole collection are the little bees that they put in. They're so sweet. They're just adorable. Now, we're going to walk around. There's a little bit of other stuff, but I want to stick with the kitchen decor, and then we'll come back and do the other things. This is a utensil holder. So cute. So, it has that beehive look to it, and then the blue trim there is so pretty. And then be happy. I mean, who can't look at that and give a little smile? Krista, you need all of this. Now, also, the utensils on these are gorgeous. There's my little butterfly. And then I think there's a bee on one of these too. Yep, there he is. These are so pretty. These are almost too pretty to use. Now, a lot of this collection is on Shop Disney, so if you see something you like, make sure you go there, take a look for it. I cannot keep any plant alive ever, but I have thought about trying to grow a little herb garden you know, I, I don't know why, but we'll try it. I don't cook and I don't grow things, but for some reason I want an herb garden. Sounds legit, right? So these are little herb markers, little stakes that you would put in the plants to let you know which ones that you have planted where. And these are $19.99. Now you can't do Winnie the Pooh without a honey jar, right? So here's our little honey jar. It's a glass jar, clear, so you can see the honey through there. Look at the little stir. And then Winnie the Pooh's on top. Look at my little bee again. Oh my gosh, I love that bee. He's so cute. Now this wouldn't just go in your kitchen, and maybe you just want like one piece of this collection. You don't want to do your whole kitchen. You could actually just add this to any current decor. I'm trying to get that so you can see the bee happy on there without breaking anything. You could add it to a bathroom sink, anywhere that you just need a little bit of hand washing. And then over here is more Winnie the Pooh stuff. This isn't necessarily um, kitchen stuff. And to me, it kind of looks like a little bit like a kid's room, but it's still super cute. I um, put this on Instagram one time. It's made for holding your kid's artwork. It has a little tiny clothespin on the back. And I put it on Instagram and said, that um, I want to get it and put like little signs there that said, I did the laundry today, I did the dishes today, I didn't scream at anyone today, I didn't throw a tantrum, I adulted, you know, stuff like that. Because adults have to, we have to take advantage of our little accomplishments in life, right? And then we have the storage bins. These are collapsible ones. Winnie the Pooh's on one of them. You've got another one that's got rainbows, and you can see like Tigger and Piglet in there, Winnie the Pooh. And then 
This is one of those like little hanging storage units. So you can just put whatever you need in there. These also work really great um, if you're going on a cruise and you need something that you can fit on a door and create a little bit of extra storage space. So this is pretty much all of the Winnie the Pooh collection. Over here, we have parts of another collection that they call the Be Happy Collection. I've heard it called the Dwell Well Collection. Super cute stuff too. It's um, got kind of a warm color palette and it's all about just being happy, kind of zen feelings. Here we have bookends. A cute little shirt. Oh my gosh, I've got shirts in the brain. A cute little picture. But it continues on. So in that same collection right here you have like a book holder or a magazine holder. I know Liz, it's all so cute. We got these. I love these little things. It's like a little notepad cube with some different colored pencils there. A little trinket tray. This design is one of my favorites. I love this little design. Back here we've got a few more things. This is another um, kind of, it's a picture, but it's got really a unique look to it. All right, now I'm gonna walk you around and start showing you more of this collection because they have the rest of it in a different place but first i'm going to show you the display right up here where they have a lot of it thrown together because it just looks so pretty now not all of this collection is new it's kind of come out in bits and pieces so you can you can kind of um see things that are new along with things that you've probably seen before let's start with the clothes most of the clothes you might have seen before especially these ears these ears have been out for a while they have the big fuzzy Sherpa bow, poofy ears. I love the Sherpa on the inside of this. It really does feel good when you wear it. Oh no, we've lost sound. Um, I'll just keep going and hopefully the sound will come back. You guys let me know if the sound comes back. I love the socks. The socks are adorable. Can anyone hear me? Give me a yes if you can hear me or something. So I know that I'm not just talking to myself out there. Yay, Donna, thank you, thank you. All right, so these look really small, but they are adult sizes, both of these. Thank you, Brittany, I appreciate that, yay. Um, crop tops are in right now. Everything Disney's doing is cropped. Maybe you love it. I'm not a huge fan, but I do really like that pattern. I think it's adorable. Yay, okay, and then, here are the shorts. I love these shorts. Love them, love them, love them. Like little lounge shorts. This pattern, it just makes me happy. I love that kind of sagey blue with the yellow and pink. Mini looks adorable as always. And they have the little sling bag. Now the sling bag is reversible, so you can wear it like this with the blue on the outside. Cute little Mickey. Got a little pocket, a little zip pocket. But you can also turn it inside out and you have the mini pattern that I'm in love with. I love it too, Nancy. This pattern is just the cutest. Now you can see over here, they have a ton of things that kind of match this pattern, kind of coordinate. Um, so kids clothes over there, the hoodie. Oh, I love this hoodie right here. Um, more kids clothes here. I do love this. I don't wear caps, but I love just the whole change your world thing that they have going on. Now these are like really long jogger shorts, like really long ones. They would come like to my calves, but they're cute. And if you don't like the sling bag, they have a cinch sack right here. It's got Mickey on it. Oh, that ice cream looks good. One little zipper pocket. This one is not reversible, but so cute. Hey, and then back, because guys, this thing is huge. This whole collection is huge. 
Um, if you remember, we did weighted plushes back, I want to say it's been almost a year ago, and they were hugely popular, but they were really heavy. I think they were about four pounds, maybe. They've introduced a smaller version of the weighted plush now that's only a pound and a half. It still, it has some weight to it. It has some heft to it. Um, but it's much easier, especially for little ones to carry. Weighted plushes are helpful in managing anxiety. They just kind of make you feel a little bit more grounded. So far today in this size, I found Mickey in that cute little color palette. And I've also found Lady over here. And she, again, has that kind of muted color palette. She goes so well with Minnie right here. Look at her little collar. I love her eyelashes too. They're very soft and again have just that little bit of heft to them. All right, you guys up for some more? I'm going to try to stick just in the homeware collection today. But, you know, pets are part of our home. So this is just a happy little summer pet collection and so fun. So I'm going to go ahead and show it to you guys too. First of all, the pet bed. Relax and recharge. Look at the lining of the outside of this. Castles. Yeah, every little fur baby needs its very own castle. That same pattern is in the little food bowl. You got Mickey there. Happy, happy, happy. They have some collars and leads. They do have a couple of different sizes of those. And then look at this. Okay, so I know this is a pet toy, but I think it's really cute. Like, I would have played with this when I was a kid. It's a little plush Mickey Mouse ice cream truck. It's got little removable ice creams, ice cream bar, Dole Whip. How cute. I would totally have played with it and cuddled it. Now here you have a toy mailbox. So you have little Mickey right there. There's some little mail, I guess, for your pet to play with. Super cute. But my favorite thing, my favorite thing is the pet bed. Love the pet bed. It kinda looks comfy, like I could sit down in that for a while. All right, now, I know that I have shown you guys this particular home collection before. I feel like I've shown it to you a million times, but it's gorgeous. So we're gonna make another really quick run through of it. Everything's done in kind of neutral tones, and it's amazing. Thank you, I'm so happy to shop with you guys this morning too. I feel like it's been a really long time since I've done a live video, and I've missed you guys. All right, so all of this again is done in like neutral tones. I'm looking for a good place to start us off. Let's start right here. We have the home pillow. It's got a gray backing there. Just in case nobody's told you today, hello gorgeous. This is a table runner. It looks like that on one side, and then on the other side you get just some pinstriping. Really pretty. Again, very neutral things you can kind of add to any decor that you already have. This mug set to me is so pretty too. You have a pink one. You have this one that's kind of a creamy with a little bit of shimmer, but then look at the inside. The neutrals are amazing because you can just throw in a piece kind of anywhere. Someone was asking about the pillow. The pillow is $49.99. So, you know, maybe you just want a little bit of Disney in your house. You just throw one of these in there. Gives you just a little touch. They also have the blue mug that matches the pink and the cream. I love that cream one. Even though I'm a pink person, I love pink. I love that cream one because of the inside. And then... This too is really cool. Just a little trivet. And the picture, because we all need a picture of the castle, right? This is the silverware. This silverware right here is all kind of silver. The handles are a matte, and you've got Mickey there. There's another set of silverware over there too that's a little bit different. And then now we have dishes. So you have a set of four plates here. They all look the same. You have the bowls. Here's the outside of the bowl. The insides of the bowls are just gorgeous. Kind of a mosaic look. And then some nesting bowls. 
that are all a little bit different. The pink cup doesn't have anything inside. The only one that does is the cream one. Um, let's see more of this. These are the kind of plants that I like because they're the only kind that I can keep alive. You have the soap dispenser. This is the churro candle right here. Ooh, I opened that and it smelled so yummy. Um, these little tiered trays are so super cool and very popular right now. Everybody's using them. This one has the little Mickey topper and it has little Mickeys on the side of it. But again, it doesn't really stand out as hugely Mickey. Now you can see that this one is rocking a little bit because these are adjustable. So obviously this one hasn't been tightened in to the correct height but so cool, I think, that it's adjustable and you can kind of make it match whatever you need. And then look at this throw. So we can't see the whole throw here, but these little fuzzy things right here make a Mickey head when you see it all laid out. I love this. It feels good. These little things feel amazing. More little trays and bowls. Had to stand on my tiptoes to get that one. Now here is the other silverware set that I was talking about a second ago. The handles are black. I'm not sure how well you can see it with the glare on there, but the handles are black. And then they've got little gold Mickey heads and the actual utensils are gold. Coming around this way, we have some more of the table linens, another table runner, some dish towels, some napkins down here. And one more little throw in that blank that pillow again because that pillow is amazing. Hi Christy, happy Saturday to you. Thank you guys again for watching. I always have so much fun doing this. Now there's one more section of the home store. Actually there's quite a bit of home stuff left, but we're gonna go with one more section. Here we go. Now this is the more like fun, whimsical, just totally colorful, happy section. So this is Mousewares. You get that fun little just cute and colorful and happy design. And it's kind of carried through a lot. So that is a huge little measuring cup. It, I actually don't know that you could use it as a measuring cup because it doesn't have any measurements on it, but it's great for like mixing and pouring like pan pancake batter or muffin mix or something. And then you have the little baking dish. Look at Mickey there. He's so cute. And a colander. Now this colander has Mickey heads. So all of your little holes in there make Mickey heads, which is so cute. Cookie cutters. And then look at this little trivet. Such a happy little guy. And then they have napkins, dish towels, lots of different, you can see all the different characters that they have right there. A little toothpick holder. And then over here you have this cute little lunch box. Look at the inside of that. So cool. And it actually has a longer handle too. Well, Disney World. This this always gives me like vintage vibes because when I first started coming to Disney back quite a while ago, um, this pattern was everywhere where they would make the Walt Disney World out of different characters. And so every time I see that it just makes me feel all nostalgic. Oh, this right here, cutting boards. I love the cutting boards. They even come with like a stand, a little holder, and then you get four different cutting boards, which is super cool. I always need cutting boards. Now, not quite in that same collection, but still kitchen oriented stuff. We have the Tiki Room apron. You have this cute little hot plate. This is gorgeous because it has all sorts of shimmer to it. We 
have the candles that everyone has gone crazy over. Well, they're candles. I have this one. I love it. I refuse to burn it. Here's a few of the others. And one more kitchen collection. This one is kind of very similar in style to the one that we looked at a second ago with all the neutrals, but this one is more of a blue and white base. It always looks very Mediterranean to me. Mugs and nesting bowls, glassware. The glass doesn't have any color to it, but you can see some etching on there. There are plates and napkins. And again, my very favorite type of plant ever in the whole wide world. A pillow down here. Oh, there's a better look at those drinking glasses. You can see the pattern there. And that is just a cute little place setting that they have already made up for us. Adorable. for holding utensils and such. And one more set of plates. So you can see the top one. These come in a set of four, and this is what they look like. And you guys will take one quick look through the mugs, and then I'll sign off. Mugs are always fun, though. It's hard to get to the mugs right now. Everybody wants them. They disappeared for a while, and now they're back. I'm so glad that they came back. I missed my mugs. This one I think is super cute. It's for the 20th anniversary, and it color changes. So when you put a hot liquid in there, the colors come up. So adorable. Also, I am a princess person. I love the princesses. And this whole little flower collection of princess mugs is just my thing. I also love that Beauty and the Beast one. So many pretty ones. There's Ariel. Got some Donald Duck over there. Toy Story characters. <laughs> <laughs> All the fun. Morning face. This one is brand new. I thought it was really cute. And I'm going to show you guys my new favorite mug. I love this mug so much. I think it is the cutest thing ever, 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 ever. I love it. Alright you guys, I think we've seen just about everything today. I'm going to take you over here and give you one more last look at this Be Well design because it is so gorgeous of a setup. And I'm going to sign off and say thank you guys so much for spending your Saturday morning with me. I had a great time. I hope you did too. Happy shopping!